Hello everyone and welcome back to Car Mechanic Simulator 2014. I'm trying to give the intro. Anyway, uh, besides the phone ringing and interrupting us, we have some cars to repair that we accepted last time. Let's see what this one wants. Uh, camshaft. Camshaft bearing cap and an oil filter. Interesting. That's more advanced than we did in uh, 2015, or 14, that's for sure. Uh, let's see, outer tie rod end, rubber bushing, spring cap. Huh. Outer bushing and spring cap, that's interesting. And disc brakes, brake pads, brake pads. It's probably front rear or two fronts. Poor brake performance. Well, I'm intrigued to start this one. No, this one, because it has that issue. Camshaft. This is intriguing. All right, so one of the things we were trying to do is read the ODB2. And if you read the comment in the last video, the ODB is not on all vehicles. It's just like in real life. Everything under 1996 can have one. It doesn't usually. Uh, there's the crankshaft pulley, but it's talking about the cam. Cam's in the top of the engine, underneath this piece right here. The head cover. All right, so let's pull out some uh, ignition coils. Take off this part. Looks like in this model, the uh, spark plugs are right into the head, not in the valve cover. Oh, I wonder if we should empty the oil. Huh. Camshaft. Camshaft. So, of course, we need to take off the timing cover, which requires the removal of several pieces, including the belt. Belt. Ah, but you got to remove the tensioner, of course. Truly is like real life when it comes to that. And, of course, the front belt has to be removed, too. All right, so we need to remove this part, right? Blocked by what? That, yeah, yeah. We're, we're making progress in the right direction. So we need to take off the water pump. Okay. There's even a hole behind it. That's awesome. Oh, and an idler roller. Usually there's a lot more screws holding this on to the engine. Okay, so we got the timing belt here. Take that off. And one of these is bad, huh? Can I tell? Let's see, examine mode? This one, condition 15. And you? Condition 76. Okay. Cool. Go to remove. Oh, yeah, gotta take the pulley out. Then we, that doesn't fit through that hole. Now there's a cap that it said too. Camshaft bearing cap. A bearing cap. Oh, wrong button, I. Uh, it's not what they're calling the gear. And there should be a bearing here, but there's not. Huh. Well, let's start examining what we can. Can't examine any of that. It's not that guy. Spark plugs. Camshaft bearing cap. Hmm. Uh, 
Well, an idea strikes me. Why don't we look at what one of those looks like on the computer? Camshaft. Oh. It's just a camshaft cap. Um, yeah, I don't see one of those on there. What do they call this camshaft anyway? Just camshaft. All right. I'm looking for just camshaft. This one. Now these usually lock these into place, but on this head it seems to be just there. Very interesting. Am I reading it wrong somehow? Oh, it's crankshaft bearing cap. I was reading it wrong. Probably over shouting at me. I'm sorry. All right, let's put this top piece back on then. We'll probably have to get it up in the air for that part. And we can put these back in. Alright, so that's back together. Now, to get it, we have to lift up the vehicle. Alright, cool. We don't have to take out the exhaust to get to it. Oh no, we didn't drain the oil. <laughs> it cost us a hundred. Dang it. That one is bad. Okay. Any other spat? <laughs> Spilling oil all over the ground. Might be the title of this episode. Alright, we got a bearing cap. Makes sense. Ah, uh, but is it a bearing cap 16? Nope, it's just a bearing cap. Yeah, since, uh... Ah, oh, man. We can just take that off then. Assembly. I guess that's a speedrun strat right there. Uh oh. I bought the wrong thing. Because <laughs> those are camps. We need crank. Crank, shaft, bearing, cap. Oh man. Perfect. I'll put the pan on there. All right, then we need the filter, which is uh, filter number 14. I really should get that tablet going. From what I've read, you can uh, use it to order parts from anywhere in the shop. Oil filter number 14. I also color code them. All right, that's all assembled. Lower you. See here. Yeah, I don't want to sell it. But we will sell that. And this piece. 
Okay. So, we need to put oil in it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Sixteen bucks. How'd that do? Perfect. All done. 536 bucks. Spent 268. I don't think that's accounting the uh, $100, you know. <laughs> Car's incomplete. Timing belt missing. Oh, right. We gotta put that stuff back. Hear me thinking it's all, uh, not what they call it. <laughs> Car Mechanic Simulator 2014 style. Where it's just a few pieces, get the job done, call it good. I appreciate that zoom in for the, for this part. Get the belt on there, tensioner. Yeah, I should probably do that to my truck. Get the uh, belt replaced. And probably get the AC working again. Do we have anything else in there to worry about? Uh oh. Inventory's not working right. A sell junk button. Sort by arrival. I'll just sell that uh, sell junk okay nothing's considered junk in that scenario okay we've got it reassembled right finish yeah well let's get this one moved that's the wrong button move to right threw me off identical all right outer tie rod repair bushing or rubber bushings and spring cap repair all running gear faults uh, that's not what I want that's not what I want let's see T and C T oh it's H there we go Oh, look at that. There's one of the culprits. Get this tire off. Alright, so there's a spring cap. We also need to do the outer tie rod, which is in the front, and rubber bushing hmm oh there's the rubber bushing and then the tie rod the question is left or right tie rod that one's fine Ah, oh, there it is. Should have a polished rim option. All right. All pieces have been identified and are being removed. All right. Tie rod. Then we need rubber bushing.
And then we need spring cap. This search option is so nice. All right, we'll get the tie rod in, the front end done. the rear oh wrong mode like why aren't I seeing this perfect next piece spring cap and then we gotta put the spring back on and we gotta put the shock absorber cap on it and of course the tire perfect okay are we done we're done make eight bucks not bad all right so you got some brake issues on this one we H and C. Can I not see the brake pads? Well, that color right there kind of tells me that that one's bad. What about over here? Oh, and this one looks bad too. The back. That one looks fine. The other side. Oh, that's the rotor there. Uh, that one looks good. Okay, so front only. And I gotta thank Blitz for his uh, shout out. Uh, we were working on uh, Astroneer. Um, I'm one of his Patreons, and uh, after some thinking and some hard work, as a joint effort, we discovered how to get to the uh, space station. Mostly his ideas, but uh, thanks again, Blitz. Okay, so take out the caliper. Brake pads. All right. I don't remember what the third thing was, but uh, we'll we'll just buy the brake pads for now. Two sets. That's eighty dollars worth. You know, usually you'd want to replace or get the rotors resurfaced before putting on new pads, but it's not required in this game. Because you know. Nice flat surface, doesn't have the noise generation. There's one wheel. There we go. And you know, new calipers don't hurt. New hardware lubricate it all so it doesn't uh, run into issues putting on these tires might be a bad idea I just just thought of because I don't remember what the other repair was brake disc brake disc really well those didn't look too crazy I'm guessing it's gonna be a rear wheel one That one seems fine. Reassemble. Uh, it's just disc. It's just one. Strange how it's spelled in the floppy kind of way. Uh, 
Oh yeah, that's the one. So if the rotor looked this bad, the pads wouldn't be doing very good either. What do we got? 81. They're fine. Uh, brake disc. And it's just brake disc. It's not vented. go and the tire perfect and finish the job for 300 bucks all right well let's see what we've got waiting in the wings okay Change engine oil and filter. List provided. Replace all filters. List provided. Okay, let's take that job. Now, I can't remember after accepting if we've tried to accept another job. So let's see here. Poor performance. Loud when accelerating. General gearbox control and repair. List provided. Fix. Find and fix any running gear problems. List provided take oh yeah that's right it does pop up with a message well I don't like the color but the car's body looks all right just transport that okay phone break problems list provided ah requires 4536 XP that's so specific um break problems let's take it Okay, move you to the right. And one more. Find and fix any running gear problems list provided. Let's take it. Oh, it's cute. All right, and we can't afford another upgrade. 1000 XP equals upgrade. Uh, because I need a tablet. All right, thank you everyone for watching. This is Billy on the Grunge MC channel. Walking around a car in Car Mechanic Simulator 2014. Why don't you look at these cars? Click on them. You may find something interesting. Sorry, I'm talking to people. Quit calling right now. We're ending the video. Bye-bye.